Once a week, Amir Hussein goes into his field to spray his crops. He uses no protective equipment. No masks, no gloves, no shoes. He steps on the poison barefoot, but doesn't think it's a bad idea. Of course I don't wear shoes or whatever on my feet. That would ruin my crops when I step on them. That wouldn't work at all. Amir doesn't think there's any dangers associated with the way he uses pesticides. Most farmers get their information on the chemicals from pesticide traders who rarely use protection themselves. If you follow the rules, then you won't have any side effects. You need to avoid spraying the pesticide into the wind. The World Bank says more than half of pesticide traders in Bangladesh report frequent health symptoms associated with acute pesticide poisoning. The air here is much cleaner than in the cities, yet many farmers end up developing breathing problems. We've got this list of 10 farmers just in this neighborhood who are suffering from respiratory illnesses that are possibly linked to pesticide exposure. Kosumuddin has been unable to walk properly because of his breathing problems for the past three years. His breathing is heavy and loud. He pauses between sentences to gulp in air. It's because of pesticides. I used to spray a gas to kill insects. I inhaled that a lot. Kosumuddin's illness is so bad that he's had to give up work. With safety information scarce, some farmers are gambling away their future without realizing it. Mahir Sattar, Al Jazeera, Bhakuta, Bangladesh.